Hello brothers and sisters, we welcome you all to the Sons of God YouTube channel. In today's video, we will be sharing with you all, a most recent message from our Lord Jesus Christ. This message was given to John Leary. As we have announced in the past, John Leary's messages are for those who are interested to know more about the refuge, as Jesus has announced that, when it's time to enter the refuge, he will let us know. We believe that through John's message, we will be informed when is the right time to start coming to the refuge, so brothers and sisters, let not forget to always listen to John's message, so that we don't miss any important information from our Lord Jesus Christ. Meanwhile, if you have questions after listening to this message to the end, please let us know on the comment session. God bless you all. Let us pray. Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful, and enkindle in them the fire of your divine love. Send forth your Spirit that we be created, and you renew the face of the earth. O God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit instructed the hearts of the faithful, grant that by the same Holy Spirit we may be truly wise and always enjoy your consolations through Christ our Lord. Amen. Thursday, September 5th, 2024. Jesus said, My people, in today's Gospel, St. Peter had tried all night to catch some fish, but he caught nothing. I came to use his boat to give a sermon to the people on the shore. Then I told St. Peter to put out into deep water for a catch, even though St. Peter did not think this was possible. But with me, all things are possible. Saint Peter followed my directions and they caught many fish, and they filled two boats until they were almost sinking. In life you meet many problems that seem impossible to solve. When I give you my directions, you need to do like Saint Peter and follow me. My son, I have asked people to store three months of food because you may see another time when your store shelves will be empty. I asked you to set up refuges for the coming tribulation, and I gave you directions to follow which you have done with your water well, your solar equipment, and your new shed. Now I directed you to have another refuge practice run which you are doing today for the seventh time. You are doing this to be ready for the coming tribulation of the Antichrist. This will be a battle of good versus evil. Be patient because these events will be starting this year. Prayer Group Jesus said, My son, you are having your prayer group meeting using your lithium batteries to run your lights and your fan. I have asked you to have this seventh refuge practice run because you will be seeing events lead up to your refuge time. I thank all of you who are participating in this exercise. You need to realize how refuge living will be your purgatory on earth. My angels will protect my refuges, and I will multiply your needs. Jesus said, My son, this well gives you water without your town water for drinking, cooking, and your latrines. I asked you to have this water well put in because you cannot exist without water. You did not think this was possible but you just had to install a backflow so the two water sources did not mix. You were given the funds to do this refuge from an inheritance. Jesus said, My son, now you are using an internet adoration, 
but during the refuge time you will have a consecrated host for your monstrance from either a priest or my angels who will bring me to you. This perpetual adoration means you need to have people sign up for a particular hour around the clock, even for this practice run. By your faith in my real presence in my host, I will be able to heal you with my luminous cross, and I will multiply your food, water, and fuels so you can survive the whole tribulation time. Jesus said, My son, I am sending a legion of angels to guard each of my refuges. They will put an invisible shield over your refuge. You saw such a picture from a GPS locator that blocked your house. The angel shields will also protect you from bombs, viruses, and even a comet. Each refuge will also have a luminous cross in the sky over your refuge. When you look on this cross with faith, you will be healed of any illness by my power. Jesus said, My people, I will bring my warning before any threat to your lives happens. You will have a life review of all of your good and bad actions. You will understand how I want you to live, and you will receive a mini judgment based on your actions to that time. You will have a short taste of your judged destination of heaven, purgatory, or hell. Keep your soul clean with frequent confession to avoid any judgment to hell. You will then come back into your body, and you will have six weeks of conversion with no evil, so you can convert your family to faith in me. Jesus said, My people, after the warning and the six weeks of conversion you will be called to my refuges with my inner locution. At that time you are to pick up your backpack or roller bag and call on your guardian angel to lead you with a flame to the nearest refuge. You need to leave your home within 20 minutes. Your angel will place an invisible shield over you. Those faithful, who do not come to my refuge, will be martyred by the evil ones. Jesus said, My people, you will see my comet of chastisement come at the end of the tribulation, and it will cause the three days of darkness. Your blessed candle will give you light. At that time I want you to place your black plastic over your windows so you do not look at my justice. The evil ones will be killed and they will be cleansed from the earth into hell. My faithful will be shielded from the comet's destruction. Then I will raise my believers into the air so you can still breathe. I will then renew the earth into another garden of Eden with many trees of life. I will then bring you down into my era of peace and you will live a long time until you die and are brought into heaven at your assigned level of heaven. Friday, September 6, 2024. Jesus said, My people, you are fortunate to be at one of my refuges that will be protected throughout the tribulation. I am showing you in this vision all of the points of life coming from my refuges. My legions of angels will be protecting my faithful at these refuges. Trust in my word that I will multiply your food, water, and fuel so you will be able to survive the terror of the Antichrist. You are witnessing this night as an example of my protection at your refuge practice run. I had you do this seventh run to help prepare you to see what my refuge life will be like. Remember that with me all things are possible, and you can trust me that I will bring you into my era of peace. Rejoice when you will see my final victory over Satan, the Antichrist, and the false prophet. Jesus said, My people, I spoke about fasting and prayer in the gospel. You sometimes need both when you are praying to remove demons from people and with a priest's exorcism. Deliverance prayers are powerful because you need to remove the demons in order to help heal addictions. During Lent you fast more from food to have self-denial so you can control the body's desires. It is good to give your body a rest from food at times. 
In the gospel I was telling my apostles not to fast while the bridegroom was with them, but they will fast when I left them. The new wine needs new wineskins, or the new wine would burst the old wineskin. I was bringing a fulfillment to the law in my new ways so I would be changing the old ways. I have given you my mass which started with the Passover, but at each mass I transubstantiate the bread and wine into my body and blood. With my perfect sacrifice on the cross, there was no longer any need to sacrifice animals. I love you all so much, and I thank those people who participated in your refuge practice run. You will appreciate my protection when the tribulation comes. Be ready to come to my refuges when I will call you with my inner locution. That comes the end of our message. Brothers and sisters, let us do well to appreciate Our Lady for this message, let tell Blessed Mother a thank you on the comment session, do this so that others are encouraged to do same, let us also give this video a like, and lastly, let us help share this message to at least one person, for the salvation of souls. God bless you all, and see you in our next message.